and we're back with another episode of Pal World. What's up, gamers? All right, we're going to head back to base. Last episode, we beat our first ever dungeon. Now we're going to head back to base uh, from where we are. And on the way, I'm not fast traveling because on the way, I just want to, like, capture some some little dudes if I can. Well, if I don't kill them right away. Uh, I want to, yeah, just catch some some creatures while I'm out here so that... Um, just because I think it's 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 good to do that a lot and um, like get a little collection going so that we can level things up. We have a few spheres to use. So we can just go around, shoot everyone with a bow. And catch them. What direction is base? I think it's through there. If I remember correctly. catch that pick that up i mean and we'll head back through and on the way up yeah we'll just we'll just catch anything that we kind of come across i guess um eventually i want to try and catch one of those mammoths but we are still way too low level to really do anything like that we should pick up this egg that i've been saying i was going to pick up multiple times and then never did oh i have a full inventory <laughs> My creatures are too powerful now. I can't do anything without killing people. There we go. Wait, I can throw balls from the back of the thing? That's sick. That means if I ever don't kill something, which is not looking likely, I can just do that. Okay, yeah, it's looking increasingly less likely. These guys we won't kill, though. Oh, okay, apparently not. Apparently we will. Wait, why are they attacking that? What, what is happening? Yeah. I want that, too. <laughs> Ah, oh, damn it. Why is it doing these triple shots? Well, there's a Melpaca. Maybe we'll be able to catch that. <laughs> it keeps doing these triple shots to finish it. My dude's just too powerful. That's right. I mean, either way, we're leveling them up and we're, we're getting resources and stuff. Oh, yeah, I should just run over them. I can probably capture chickpeas, like, pretty easily now. Oh, that's our fox bots. Nearly killed them. All right, back to base. Checking out what's next, really. So much wool. So much wool. So much excess wool. All right. Why are my dudes always depressed? What can I do to make them less depressed? All right. I need to load everything up. I, at some point, I need to make a more efficient like inventory system because my inventory system is not efficient. It, there's, it's just like I have random spots for everything, you know? Peldium. Rope. Wood, sure. Or put the ore in there instead. Where's the wood go? And none of them, apparently. Oh, yeah, sulfur. That's heavy. Okay, now we're probably pretty good. We'll put our TMs away. I should probably use some of these at some point. I never really used them. I don't know what the rubies are for. We'll put them away. Okay, let's have a look at the at the technology tree here because I want to see if there's a way to make it so that um, I want to try hanging a hanging trap. That seems funny. We should build one of those at some point. But I want to see if there's a way to make it so that the pals are happier. Set up a bar, enjoy and enjoy life with your pals. No, Malpaca saddle, 
Jolt Hog's gloves. Ooh. Gloves for him too. Use him as a glider. Wait, throw electric grenades. That's that's epic. Headband, headband, beautiful feather headband somehow protects its wearer, wearer, wearer from lethal head injuries. That's probably useful in all honesty. A bear trap, nice. Wooden gate, meat cleaver. Oh, that's for butchering. We, we don't need that. Tansy assault rifle. Is that better than the submachine gun? Oh, that's different. Okay, yeah, we should get that. <laughs> Chill it saddle. Yeah, I don't want to run out of points though. Um... A viewing cage. Interesting. Container for observing captured pals. Um, it doesn't really seem like there's anything that's going to improve their, like, their, like, state of being. Just seems like they're unhappy. Let's create, let's focus on creating a breeding farm here. So we need fiber and we need wood. I think we get them both from trees, so that's, that's easy. We definitely get wood from trees. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, we do. We got fiber and wood. I want to know why he's... It just says extremely unhealthy, unhealthy due to neglect. Why is he being neglected? Is he being neglected by me? Am I the problem? All right, we can now make our breeding farm. This is exciting. This is exciting. This is our first step into, geez, this thing is huge. Our first step, how long is this gonna take? Oh, not that long. This is our first step into making sure, I mean, not into making sure, into making like, hybrid pals i don't know i don't know uh, like anything about it i don't know if you can just mix any two pals together or if it's like they have to be similar or something but i'm very excited to find out also we should probably we should probably do the things that we need to do to level up our our settlement okay here we go so, male and female not present, not enough cake. Hey, what, you saying I don't got enough cake? How do we make cake? How do we make cake? Fluffy pal bed. Oh, that's like a nicer bed for them. How do we make cake? Well, I assume part of making cake is, um, is making the the mill and the um where's the thing that makes where's the wheat farm did we not unlock the wheat farm yeah wheat plantation where is it oh there so oh yeah but we don't have wheat seeds we need to figure out where to get wheat seeds from i guess we need to go exploring and find some wheat seeds That's really annoying. <laughs> I don't know where to find wheat seeds. But I guess we just got to go exploring. I wonder if they sell wheat seeds in the settlement. Let's go have a look. Although, I probably don't want to be buying that sort of stuff. I wonder if it tells us in the survival guide. Mm, capturing pals, hunger, sanity. Pals hunger at this hundred. Feed pals quality food and let them rest in the hot spring to recover their sanity. Okay. I mean, I knew about that. I didn't know I could make them though. Anything? Pal eggs, pal breeding farm. It says, pal breeding farm, assign a male and female pal to a breeding farm and place a cake with them. Later, you may find an e a pal egg. Some special combinations of pals give birth to special eggs. Oh, only some. Interesting. Hmm. 
Well, that didn't tell us anything about how to find cake. How to how to make cake. I didn't see cake in the technology tree. You got any wheat seeds, buddy? Oh, you do. Nice. I think I needed three. Let me just make sure. Yeah, three. What about for the mill? Do I need wheat seeds for the mill? No. Do you have anything else I might want? Let's have a look. Milk. I feel like milk will be used. I feel like wheat, eggs, and milk will make cake, right? Let's buy some milk. Buy 10 milk. We have lots of eggs. Maybe we'll buy some wheat. And let's, we'll, we'll just have a look. Oh, maybe we just make cake like at the, at the cooking thing. Like maybe it's not something that we need to um, worry too much about. Like maybe it's just like not in the technology tree is what I'm trying to say. All right, let's head back to base. See if we can make some cake. Ooh. Shiny. Hello, shine. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a, a sheep. I just want to quickly check this though. Nope, cake's not there. But it could be in the um. Didn't we make like a fancy cooking thing? Like a cook pot? I don't know. Okay, let's make them not attack. This thing is not good. <laughs> it's level two. We're going to be fine. What is that move? <laughs> Bro. What was that? Okay, we, we almost definitely got that. Epic. I like catching shinies. Who doesn't though? Okay, so I think there was like a, a special cooking thing. Yeah, a cooking pot. I'm going to assume a cooking pot allows us to make cake maybe. But first, let's place down our wheat plantation, which we need more wood for. We just seem to endlessly need wood. It can be over here. And then we also need the... We have the mill. Oh, we should make a large toolbox. We have the mill. Um, what was the last thing we needed to make? Mill, wheat plantation, and cook pot. Okay, so the thing that I wanted to make anyway. How much metal do we actually have? How many? Okay, we need more. Metal seems to be a big problem for us. I have a feeling metal is going to continue to be a big problem for a long time. Unless we solve it. Hot oh, milk. Cute. Alright, what were we making? <laughs> I already forgot. Um... What was I getting wood for? It was just for this, right? Wait, this never got made. Useless team. What can I feed my pal team? I, I really, I need to probably go out and make some food really. Well, no, I don't need to make some food. I have 600 berries in here. I just need to take half of them. And then I need to cook them. Okay. Let's do that. Okay, you work on that, little buddy. 
Do I really have nothing to eat? do that okay i'm gonna go get some my some wheat now i heard that there was something that you can do i mean not some wheat some iron i heard you can get a rush bore saddle none of my dudes are ever doing handiwork very annoying but i heard that you can get a rush bore saddle and then you can use a rush bore's attack to attack the ore, and it takes out the ore quicker. Although, honestly, um, it seems like mining the ore doesn't take that long anyway, but we'll see. We have a rush ball. We may as well check it out. And what we'll do is we'll bring some cativas and a rush ball, and then we'll go out and we'll get some, some things. So, cativa. Cativa. Uh... Sort by level. What's our highest level rush bore? This dude. You can replace that. And then another Kativa. The Kativas are so that, uh, because Kativas um, help with carry weight. So now we can carry 800. We'll bring out our rush bore. Okay, so what I heard is that you can do a reckless charge. And it will like, destroy the ore. Oh, interesting. It does. Oh. <laughs> okay, whoops. I don't know if this is actually much faster. Yeah, you got a problem? It's just to chill it down there with a bunch of stone. <laughs> okay, how much ore did that get us? 41. I mean, I'm just going to have to assume that that's better than what we have been doing. Because I don't really have a point of comparison. 10 ore. I mean, it doesn't seem bad. 21 ore. Okay, now I'm carrying too many items. 81 ore. Okay. I mean, it certainly seems like... Like an okay way of doing it. I think our, uh, one of our problems with the efficiency of our base right now is that I built the this thing. I think if we didn't have this thing, then it would probably be better. Because honestly, we don't need we don't need the amount of wool that we're getting right now. I don't really use wool for much, so it's kind of not that useful for me to have that thing going. Ever so slowly, make our way there. <laughs> Come on, get in there. Doesn't really matter where I put it because it's about to get smelted anyway. Okay. 45, that's something. It is it is slow, isn't it? Oh, that turns it into flour. So we probably need to do that before we can make um, 
We probably need to do that before we can make cake. I think we need to reassess what we have here. So we probably don't need the fluff ball. Maybe we, let, let's just maybe completely reassess. Okay. This guy's good for mining. This guy's good for like smithing and stuff. This one's good for um, like doing the farming. Kativas are good like generalists. Penglet is good for watering things and also just like helping out with things. Um, oh, that one has level three seeding, but that means it's only good for seeding. I mean, he's only good for campfire. Oh no, and smithing, and smithing. What else? It seems like the Kativas are good generalists, really. He's good for getting wood. We do need something, something, something for getting wood, so we'll get him. Maybe we... Oh, we've already got a penguin. These are kind of semi-decent generalists, really. Oh, Lift Monk's good. Lift Monk's a great... I mean, that's not Lift Monk. Oh, yeah, it is. Lift Monk's a, a great generalist. So is Tansy. Probably good to have some generalists. Fuddler's good at mining and helping. Just, like, handiwork. And then the deer's good for wood. I think that's probably a decent little mix-up that we got there. I would say. Now we just gotta hope it all works out alright. <laughs> Which I'm sure it will. Okay. Now what were we trying to make? We were trying to make a... Cooking pot. Which we always need more wood. That's all we need now. Okay, wood. Good, good, good. Yeah, we definitely are going to, at some point, need to make a metal ingot farm. Because we, we're really constantly struggling with the metal ingots. Okay, we'll put this right here beside the other one. This has just kind of been like a... This has kind of just been like a, 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 a general, like, base building episode and, and sorting that sort of stuff out. Cake. Honey. We need honey. So we need to figure out how to get honey and, and milk. I'm assuming that is going to be like... I'm assuming that's going to be... So the egg layer, obviously we know what the egg layers are. I don't... Like, I assume we're going to have to have somewhere to put them to lay their eggs? Maybe? I don't know how it's gonna... how it's gonna work, really. So... I know that it says that the chickens are egg layers. Sheep and fowl-like pals. Assign a pal with the appropriate trait to produce... Okay, so... Okay. So if we put the, if we put chickpeas in here, I assume they'll make eggs for us instead of wool. And then I assume we need some sort of cow. Produce a weapon workbench. That I can do. Have we unlocked that yet? No. Next level. Oh, what was the other thing I wanted to make? Oh, that's right. A toolbox. Which is wood ingots and nails. Oh, we need quite a lot more ingots. 
Okay, so what ta what is the milk called? Can be milked from mozzarella. So we need to figure out where we can find a mozzarella. Like maybe maybe I'll just look it up and look up a map. Because I think that would be pretty pretty useful. Is that cheating? <laughs> I don't know. But I think we need it. We need that mozzarella thing. Um, if we're gonna if we're gonna get into breeding. So we obviously have chickpeas that are going to produce eggs for us. We have the wheat being produced over here. We have... What else do we need? Wheat. Red berries we have plenty of. Eggs, yeah, we'll, we'll get a lot of. And honey. So we need to figure out how to get honey. How do we get honey? Good job on the ingots, buddy. Yeah, honey's going to be a tough one. I wonder if they sell honey at the uh, at the place. Let's just check that out, and then maybe we'll we'll end out this episode here. Just a kind of general chill episode. But I do want to see how we get honey. Do you have honey? No honey. Hmm. Where do we get honey? I mean, I'm going to assume that there's just an insect type pal and then th that we use that insect type pal to generate honey. I think that's pretty straightforward, but it's just a matter of what the insect type pal is. Oh, there's a mozzarella. Oh, maybe we should buy one. Yeah, I think we should try and buy one. So we're going to need to sell some stuff. Let's sell. Those are way too cheap. Yeah, we could sell that. Um, we don't need these two level one chillets. We'll keep one of them as a, one, one female one. Um, those are two. Those both are female. Those are both male. We have quite a few of these. Quite a few fox bots. Male, female, female, male. We just need to keep a female and a male, really. Okay, that's going to give us 1,700. I mean, 1,500. We need quite a lot more here. Um, we'll sell one of these. We'll sell those two. We'll sell all the chickpeas. Apart from two of them, we need some egg layers. We'll sell some cativas. We'll sell... That chickpea's a workaholic. That's a good trait. <laughs> um, sell that one. Sell that one. Slowly making a bit more here. I wish I could sort by value. Or even sort them in general, really. Um, Three hundred and forty-five for a dire howl, but I've only got one of them, so I don't really want to sell it. Hmm. Oh, it's hard to choose what to sell. <laughs> it's hard. Okay, let's see. That puts us at 5,000. Is that enough? Oh, it's 7,000. Jeez, we need heaps. We need to make another two grand. That's 500. Sell these cativas. I mean, I guess we should just get rid of everything that's easy to catch. Because, like, we can go out and catch these things like, like it's nothing. And it's not like they're high level. The ones that I have. Come on, a little more, a little more. Those are pretty easy to catch. That's pretty easy to catch. I mean, really, most of these are probably pretty easy to catch if we know where to find them. It's just a matter of actually knowing where to find them. There we go, two grand. Okay, do we have enough now? Okay. 
that was probably silly. That was probably silly. Let's be realistic. But we now have a, Mon a Mozarina, and we can have that until we find them in the wild. I mean, we'll, we'll, we'll keep it, but, you know, it'll be useful until we find one in the, in the wild. So let's do this. Let's put our cow out. Our cow out. We'll replace. Hmm. I think we'll replace that with the cow. But if we have the cow, the cow's cute. It's huge. If 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 we have the cow, we need to throw the cow into the thing. But I think if we have the cow, we need someone to tend to the to the farm. Oh wait, I didn't actually need to replace anything. No work available in the vicinity. How do I... How do they work? <laughs> How do you work? Let me just... Let me just quickly look at the survival guide on farming. There's got to be one on farming, right? No eggs. Partner skills, pals and party, base. Is there not one on farming? Am I crazy? I don't see one on, on farming. But all I know is that we need a farmer, which I don't know if we have. I think I remember one of these. This one. No. Is that a farmer? Is that how they work? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> Let me have a look at this thing. Is that, Can we like access it at all? It just says requires farming. If we look at it in the technology tree. Um, where is it? Ranch. Uh, farm for raising sheep and fowl like pals. Assign a pal to the appropriate with the appropriate traits to farm to automatically produce items. Current task grazing. Current task grazing. Okay. So I guess this one's probably going to produce berries and this one's going to produce milk. I'm going to assume. I don't really need the milk. I don't really need the berry one, but that's okay. Maybe it'll produce something else. Okay, well, I think that's the end of this episode. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. We've kind of been uh, progressing a bit here and, and seeing how this will go. Um, and and we're, we're, I, I feel like we're slowly figuring everything out. I'm very excited to get to a point where we are making eggs. I think that's going to be so fun. I think that's going to be sick. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very excited for that. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will see you guys. Oh, we got our first milk. I will see you guys next time. Um, yeah, peace out. And yeah, leave a comment. Let me know. Tell me if you're enjoying it. Okay, what did she drop? I just want to see that red berries. Yeah, we don't really need her in there because... Sorry, I know that I'm getting distracted, but we don't really need that in there because I don't really need anything producing berries for me right now. I've got two berry farms. So let's replace her with something actually more useful. Um, like... What's more useful? <laughs> like this, like the fuddler. The fuddler was good. We'll put the fuddler back on. All right. Thanks, guys. See you later.